What's up? Hey everyone, Space Boy CT here, back at the house once again. And I hope there's not a fly in here, because of us, send help, please. But anyways, today, today we are going to be reacting to a trailer that I did not even know came out five days ago. Which is for the movie, Hit Pig. And if you aren't aware on what Hit Pig is, it's basically an adaptation of a book, of a children's book called Pete and Pickles. Made by the author who did Mars Eats Moms and all that stuff. It was originally going to be done by DreamWorks Animation, but they abandoned it soon afterwards in 2014. Probably because of the whole downsizing and stuff. But it was thankfully revived in 2020 by, by Anna Fancho and Cinecite, the guys who did Pause of Fear, The Left of Hank. It's being distributed by FIFA Pictures, the guys who did um, Food Fight, Monster Family, uh, Wally Ward Wasos and Dragon Keeper. And has a pretty interesting cast. Oh, by the way, before we continue, I forgot to mention, um, FIFA Kids also picked up the US distribution rights to the Scary Girl movie from Australia based on a beat, based on the pop, based on the obscure but very stylized video game of, of the same name. Pretty nice, actually. I actually saw the trailer without muted, Sally. And I actually like how the am movie's animation had. Uh, uh, I like how it's CG, but it, it replicates a stop motion vibe very nicely. Uh, so, of course, you got Lily Singh from Ice Age Collision Course and the Bad Guys. She was also a YouTuber. Wayne Wilson <clears throat> from Monsters vs. Aliens and Smoke's Lost Village. Music art, Brazilian artist Anita, pretty nice. Wu Paul from Wu Paul's Drag Race, Nimona, and Tros. And together, Charlie Hello, he's a recognizable voice actor. He was even in Pet um, Pet Alien. Fly for Fly, which no, I did not even know he was gonna be in this. We all know Fly for Fly. Fly for Fly! And of course, for the main character, Hit Pig, he was originally gonna be voiced by Peter Dinklage. But they decide but they would cast him with Jason Sudeikis from the Angry Birds movie Epic and um and even next gen. He was also in the Inkabuds movie sequel and gonna be in the third one. I do understand why they would recast him, because Theo Diglish was always in the Inkabuds movie with um Jason. Plus, I feel I feel like Jason does better at the voice actor wall as opposed to Peter Dinklage. No offense, I think, you know. So yeah, I can tell totally, under, totally understand the recast. I support that. But yeah, this is pretty interesting actually. I am, I'm actually hoping to check this one out, because I hope this place actually takes place in like a future... In like a futuristic cyberpunk world, which I'm actually starting to become more of a fan of. I've been a fan of, starting to become a fan of since like, what, 2023? And that's all, oh, 2022? And that, that's all thanks to next gen, keep in mind. Honestly, it's really nice. It is really actually nice. Like, like, it's just... I just really, really love it. I'm hoping this film turns out somewhat good. But then again, it's being distributed by Fever Pictures, and the trailer for it came in like five days ago. That is insane. But anyways, before we check out the film, I have two shoutouts. The first shoutout is to a friend of mine named Christian. We used to go to the same high school together. And the, sec the second shout out is to a friend of mine named Honey Glaze. April, August 22nd is officially her birthday, so I'm give is officially um yeah her birthday, so I'm giving her this amazing shout out to wish her a happy birthday. Anyways, since we're all in a, on that good moment, let's go ahead and check out the trailer, shall we? Trailer in three, two, one. Here we go. It's playing. You got the um Motion Pictures Association, yeah. When your kitties left the city, Ooh. when your moose is on the loose, Whoa. when your cow has said chow, 
You need me. Hit big. Aha! Bounty hunter. I hear you're the best. What'd you lose? My elephant! Whoa. Someone pilfered pickles! Who steals elephants? I mean, besides me. <laughs> Make me an offer I can't refuse. One million bucks. Oh, that, you know, that's about a hundred times more than I was thinking, so, uh, yes. Catch her! Yeah. <laughs> yep. Activate propulsion booster. Oh, this is spelled the Mossy Smobs. And pop up the rock and roll. Wow. Whoa. Well, well, well. No more cages for me. The Leapin' Lord wanted a cute little elephant for his show. I've been locked in a cage ever since. Is that Lois? Until you rescued me. Now I've never felt more free. All thanks to you. It seems you've lost your way. I'm finding it, actually. Hey, Pickles, we gotta go. Don't ever run away again. Where's Pickles? The Leaping Lord took her. And I need to save her. We're going with you. Fluffy, a little help? Is this part of the plane? Fasten your seatbelt! Oh! Yeah, boy! And that is why Taylor Swift would be a great president. Ha! My mom will be proud of that. Beat your heart out, Dumbo! 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. You got a plan, pork chop? I already called for backup. If this is really about saving an elephant, eh? I'm in. Plus, you know, you said something about a million bucks. Yeah. Yeah. Can you sign one more? It's to my nephew. Yeah. What's his name? Uh, my, uh, his name. Uh, yeah. Uh, hit pig. Ha. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I have a good. I actually like that. I think what's really bad about this is that Sinicide was able to get make the animation a lot more expressive here than with possibly the Electric Pain. And I think what's really nice is the designs. I think I think what's really nice is that they went with a kind of a Pixel vibe almost, not super realistic, but like. More realistic enough to be more pleasant, not uncanny. Like the cows have textures, but they don't. But they're not. But they're thankfully not well for realistic, unlike freaking Mars eats moms. <laughs> but yeah, I actually like that. And I think, J and I'm, I'm actually, I actually love Jason's role in this. He is really expressive, up to two point seven. So mad props to you, Jason Seducus. Hopefully I'm pronouncing your last name correctly. But yeah, that was the hit pick trailer. Hope you guys like it. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below on which video you guys want me to react to next. And before we go, I have one thing to say. I hope this movie is turns out a lot better than Cyberpunk 2077. <laughs> Scott the Waz would be pr pretty proud of me for saying that. Anyways, Space Boy CT. Out. Yeet. The end.